everybody, it's Carl. Welcome back to the bathroom. It's Monday night. That means it's time for the Monday night shave. Hope everybody is doing well. I'm doing pretty good. It's good to be back with you guys. It's been quite a while and uh, no real reason. Just haven't been making any content at all. But tonight I am here back to do a shave. And tonight's shave was is going to be all things chosen by my sweet lady friend. Um, like I said a few uh, a few weeks ago, maybe in my last shave even, uh, she came through and liked to smell some of my scents and stuff and uh, wanted to pick a shave. I told her no because I was uh, being a knucklehead and I wanted to finish that tube of Arco. But she was here not too terribly long ago and uh, let her pick out the shave. So what are we using today? Well, she chose the Old Spice Original Shave Cream with the matching Old Spice Aftershave. So we'll be lathering that up in the Custom Doug Smith brush. And she chose to use the Atomic Rocket, or for me to use the Atomic Rocket uh, by PAA for the brush. And she didn't choose a razor, so I went ahead and chose one. And I'm just gonna be using the Magic Shave Chevette. It's got a Permasharp. This will be the second shave on that blade. All right, so I'm fresh out of the shower. It's been a pretty typical Monday for me. Got about a dollop of uh, shaving cream in the bowl. Let's get louder. Yeah, so pretty typical Monday for me. Um, Monday's my normal days off. So I woke up this morning after I slept in, slept until about 7.30, 8 o'clock, somewhere around there. Got dressed, went for a ruck, um, because I am definitely out of shape and I need to get back into that. So I've been trying to, to ruck a couple, two or three days a week. Um, today the weather was nice. I was home. It wasn't terribly hot yet, so I figured I'd get it knocked out early. Went for a uh, 5K ruck, actually just, just over 5K. Working to earn a patch, and it was the, uh, the patch was called the Kids Patch or the kids rucking challenge is what it was and the uh, challenge was to take a kid for a ruck or if you don't have access to a kid which i do not you can um carry extra weight at least 20 pounds for the 5k so that's what i did i got one of my uh, exercise sandbags filled it up and uh 3.4 miles just over 5k got it knocked out in eh. A little over an hour, like an hour and four minutes. So not fast, but not, uh, yeah, not fast. I can't say not terribly slow because it was. Um, definitely compared to how, to the speeds I used to be able to do. But I'll get back there. Felt good to get out and rock. The back held up nice. It's been holding up nice. Um, I've been doing two kind of regular base mile rucks a week between like two and three miles. And then I try and do one like challenge or long ruck. Um, so today was the challenge, it was the extra weight. So, gosh, I forgot how big this brush is. It just just spreads the lather so quick. <laughs> and uh, as you can see, it didn't take much time at all to build that lather. This is actually pretty, pretty thick. See if I can't thin it out just a touch. I'm gonna call that good, this old spice is uh, from India. Um, we don't get stuff like this here in the States, but the only Old Spice stuff you get here in the States now is shaving cream, or not shaving cream, um, shower gel, and uh, soap, body soap, shower gel. I think they have deodorant and spray deodorant or spray scent and then of course the classical spice 
which those of you who are connoisseurs know, it is not the original Old Spice scent. And for whatever weird reason this is, this soap doesn't really match the aftershave. They go well together, but they are definitely not the same scent. Been a while since I shaved with a Chevet, so I am expecting blood. So for the most part, I've been doing utility shaves just to get ready for work. Nothing exciting. Working through, like I said, that Arco that I finished. And I started, um, Trying to work my way through a stick of Leah that I want to try and finish off. And that's a good regular shaver. I mean, it's got a nice clean scent. It's a very serviceable soap. Nothing to write home about, but it works. This, uh, I forgot how nice this Old Spice is. It's got a kind of a manly, soapy scent. Kind of clean and fresh. Maybe just a touch chemically. But it's plenty slick. Plenty of cushion. I remember this was my first Chevette or Chevette and this thing used to murder me I mean if you go back in the archives I think the first time I tried to shave with it is chronicled on camera and I think I sliced myself a million times in the first 30 seconds of the video. And now, while I'm not a pro, I've definitely gotten a little bit better over the years. Speaking of over the years, My wet shaving anniversary is coming up. My birthday is right around the corner, and that's when I started wet shaving. I bought my first uh, wet shaving setup. as a birthday gift for myself. Back in, gosh, 2014, 15, somewhere in there. Maybe 2013, but I don't think so. I think it was 20, summer of 2014. The old Microtouch 1 and the Vanderhagen 
the, the deluxe, the one that you could buy at the local pharmacy with the green bowl and the brush and the soap. Yeah, not a bad first pass, not a bad first pass. I think I may have lathered up a little much soap, but that's all right. Yeah, so my wet shave anniversary is coming up and my birthday's coming up. Probably maybe six, eight months a year after I started wet shaving, I got this shavette. And uh, struggled and struggled to learn how to use it. I got it down and People have been graciously enough to, or gracious enough. To compliment my techniques and so. Guess I've done something right over the years. So my birthday's coming up, like I said. And my sweet lady friend has planned a surprise for me. I don't know what it is. I don't know where it is. But I know we're gonna go on a little getaway for the weekend, so I'm excited about that. Sure, it'll be an amazing trip. Sorry, I just got a family group text, so I'll raise it when I'm done. So yeah, birthday surprise. I don't know what it is. Like I said, I'm sure it'll be amazing. But the only thing I know for sure is there's no TV. Which is fine with me. We don't watch much TV anyway, except for YouTube. Second pass, fantastic. Even YouTube content I haven't been watching a ton of. A couple videos here and there by old Solid Shaves, Mati. Don't really comment. Haven't really been commenting on anything though. Um, Just nicked myself. Mm. I knew it was gonna happen too. I mean, this felt bad when I started that little stroke. That's gonna be a good one too. Oh yeah, that's a good one. That's like a legit cut. Well, I told you guys when I started, I felt like there'd be blood and I took a minute and tooted my own horn and it.
guess I hadn't learned too much. I think what happened is I kind of, was when I was coming across, I think I tilted the blade just a touch and paid the price. It happened as I was coming around the, the chic bone. Like in one of my last videos, I said work was getting back to normal. Once again, I think I spoke too soon. That pesky old virus is starting to make a comeback here in our area. So. It'll be interesting to see how things develop over the next couple of weeks. The numbers are on the rise. The hospitalizations are on the rise. Congregate settings and nursing homes are having outbreaks again. So it'll be interesting. Thing is, is you know, we're a year and a half into it. So I think may be wrong been wrong before but I think like most of the um, facilities and businesses and whatnot since we've been dealing with it for a year have you know um, plans and strategies and resources in place hopefully so we won't get pulled into it quite as much as we did last year but only time will tell all right so just that one nick right there a little bit of irritation on my neck that's probably one because i'm not used to shaving with a, sh a chevette anymore and two because my technique is not that great anymore because I'm not used to shaving with it. But it's a very nice shave, very smooth. Um, we'll, we'll spot back there. I'll probably have to touch up with the, with the razor razor because I'm not going to. Yeah. So anyway, beautiful shave. Alan didn't really tell me too terribly much. It did a good job stopping that bleed. So a little aftershave, a little Old Spice action classic scent very similar to the one I remember my old man wearing but not exactly the same a lot of people aren't a big fan of the Old Spice I like it because when it dries down it's got a nice uh, powder scent it's got some floral and some spice at the beginning and like I said as it dries down it leaves a nice powdery lingering scent. All right, beautiful shave. Just that one little knicker. That's what I get for hyping myself up. Anyway, thank you guys and gals so much for spending a little time with me. I hope you enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it. No matter what you do, go spend some time with your friends and family because it is very important. And speaking of that, I've got to answer this family text message. So I'm going to cut it right there. Take care. I'll see you next time. Thanks for all the support. God bless.